A Columbus family is learning just how unbreakable a bond can be. A Belgian metal detectorist is on a mission now to return lost World War II relics to their owners. He discovered a sweetheart bracelet lost during World War II at the site of the Battle of the Bulge. He traced it back to a family in Westerville. Today, they all met for the first time to return this symbol of love home. NBC4's Anna Hoffman was there for this reunion. She tells us about this emotional journey. This reunion was like a flame reignited. The bracelet belonged to Army soldier Eugene Coley. It was a gift from his then soon to be wife. His family didn't even know it existed until recently. Need to keep these these stories alive. When Randy Bulins discovered this bracelet at the site of the Battle of the Bulge, he knew it was special. I wanted to know the rest of the story. The bracelet belonged to Eugene Coley, a soldier in the 202nd Combat Army Corps of Engineers, an Ohio native known for fighting in the Battle of the Bulge and building a bridge over the Rhine. The bracelet was a gift from Coley's then future wife, Marcille. On the front is his name. On the back reads, your sweetheart, Marcille. That's something very emotional, um, so I really had to return this to the family. People, strangers from all over the state saying, Randy is trying to get a hold of you. And I'm like, who's Randy? Now, months later, he has traveled all the way from Belgium to central Ohio to bring this relic home. We had no idea. Uh, he never talked about it. She never did. Eugene died in 2015 and Marcel died in 2016, but their lineage still lives on through their daughter, granddaughter and great grandchildren. We found <laughs> his diary that he had during the war and it shows different dates and where he went. His diary actually showed the dates and it confirmed with the location of where Randy found this. That was your great grandpa. Now this symbol of love is creating an unlikely friendship. This is like the culmination today of of, of that. Uh, so we're very appreciative and a reminder to honor those who have served. These guys liberated us almost eight years ago, and it's the least I can do for them to, to return a favor, I guess. The family tells me Eugene and Marcel fell in love when they were just 13 years old, and they were married for 69 years. This is the seventh relic Mullen has returned to families in the United States. He tells me he still has a few more left to go.